How's it going, YouTube? Back with another sugar free review. Got a new Katsu. Never had this knock brand on the channel before. This is the CK01. You can find these on Amazon where I first seen them. Yeah, this one's $246. So definitely not cheap. But the question is, is it worth it? We'll get into that. Got a 3.5 inch. ZDP 189 blade, satin finish, very high polished, and it's a convex grind. Oh, can't pick it up. If you're not sure what that is. But I remember I'll put a picture up on the screen. But yes, yeah, the first folder I've ever gotten with a convex grind. Yeah, drop point blade. You've got a four millimeter blade stock 0.15 inches let's check out the factory edge very 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 sharp don't want to spoil it but i got a 60 on my tester with this one well Got an overall length of 8.05 in or 8 point, just 8 inches, my bad. <laughs> Let's do some size comparisons. Kaiser Militaw, also 8 inches. Yeah. Kenwood Padre. Yeah, I was right. This is 8.05. Artisan Cutlery Ornis. Spiderco Mannix, two. All pretty close to the same length. Good comparisons. You got a 4.5 inch handle, 0.54 inches wide. And you do have T6s, but very minimal hardware. And you got a weight of 4.73 ounces, no weight relief on the inside. Not sure why they did that. You do have a titanium milled clip that is non reversible, goes in and out of the pocket very easy. Almost too easy. And the handle. It's a blasted, contoured titanium. Very smooth finish on it. Is that going to be a good thing or a bad thing? Depends on how you look at it. And it is a frame lock. Very good lock up and access. Pretty good action. Your only deployment method is this front flipper. Very easy to front flip. Could stand for the detent to be a little bit stronger, but it's not bad. Do you have a titanium backspacer matching? No Leonard hole. Unfortunately, you have a very bad sharp wrench hole. It's gone past small. You can see the ZDP 189. You see that line? In case you don't know what ZDP 189 is, it's two different seals. The inside core is the, I guess you could say, the badass one with the good edge retention. And outside, it's the more stainless part. Yeah, this locks on this knife. I always love to see the lock cut out on the inside. Looks better. T6s, not a fan of those. They didn't do any weight relief. And 
and it's a bit expensive, especially for a newer brand. But is it worth it? Sure, yeah, ZDP 189 is a good steal, great steal. You got titanium, front flipper, nicely done. So if you like it, definitely good price. Yeah, I will have this knife linked down below if you want to pick one up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a like and a comment, and I will see you on the next one.